1994 Lonnie Mack Gibson Custom Shop Les Paul. It's the only one the world has ever made in natural, whatever the heck color you call it. 7.8 pounds. Uh, the guy, I've last seen Lonnie Mack. I guess he had a natural one. He always has a red one. This was custom made for customer. It's a collector own. It's collector. There ain't a mark anywhere, as you know. 99 out of 100% mint. It's collector own. I'm probably the only nutcake that's playing with it. I just put strings on it, just the neck, clean up the fretboard. Just to pull pieces on the pickups because they're a factory. Just give me a break. You gotta make it mean. It's got the Bigsby. Comes with the case, a little letter where he wrote Gibson. I don't know. You know, you'll see the pictures. It's a cool guitar. And uh this Bigsby's a man's Bigsby. I mean, with all this, this is like metal. This ain't no cheap crap. But the wood is light. Big knack. Big big frets. Going into my little Saldano with a sure riot because I felt like being dirty. Sound wise. These pickups are the patent applied. Killer! I think uh, it's, it's special that it's in this guitar. It's mean, I mean, uh, you know, you can just play here like this, and when your mother-in-law comes by, you know how they are. Oh, turn it down. Okay. 50 years old, they're still trying to tell you.
fat sound to it, you know, of course, Gibson, but I don't know. It feels very strange by 24 frets. I bought, I'm guessing I had it close to a year now, and I put a couple pictures on with no write-up, and then like a year later I go, oh, I never finished that. Comes in a nice case, all the stuff. I can't even like get it in the camera, it's pretty big. It's a V, baby. V for Vegas. That sounds stupid. Look at it. You want to talk about having one of them rare ones? Oh, we need to see the neck. <laughs> 